um, they're directly affected by, by these decisions, you know. Um, whatever Alukir will do will change the life of Maura in South Sudan, where she is. Um, and not only Maura's, but all the like young girls and women of the, the, that country. So, um, so that's, I think that's the most inspiring part. And also what's interesting is you have countries that are still at war, like Yemen. You have countries that are transitioning into peace, countries that are at peace, but where, you know, there's still a lot of tensions. And I think the women play a key role in making sure that these tensions don't bring the country back on the brink of war. Like they manage diffusing all these tensions ahead of time in their communities, like uh, Muna Awata, Do you have this woman. So we don't have Palestine, we have Lebanon and Yemen. Oh, oh. Because so we work with um, uh, UNDPPA, UNDPO and UN Women. And we were also, we only had a couple of months to organize all of this, so we right. had to limit ourselves. But I'm from, I live in Jordan, actually. Oh, oh, so I'm very oh. close to the conflict there. Um, but now we, we had to stick to a limited amount of countries. We have eight, which is already a lot, and 14 women. Uh-huh. So.